<laughs> you are on the old lake, buddy. Going for lake trout today, folks. As you can see, beautiful day. Flat calm. No wind. I'm going to die about one degree out, but it's nice. We're going to get the old portable set up and see if we can't get some slotches. All right. Got two rainbow traps set out, as you can see. Um, it's only about two and a half feet of water. We got the hut right there. So we're gonna jig for Lakers. Give this an hour or two, see if a rainbow, big old bull rainbow don't come swimming in. If not, move them 20 feet out, nothing. We'll put them out for Lakers. Maybe we'll get lucky with the cusk. But stay tuned, we'll get you back when we're jigging. She wrote? No, I don't think so. Oh, uh, no, she's still going. We might be deep enough here. I think we might be too. Well, well let's try it here for. Oh, that's all she wrote. That's all she wrote. Hold on. Gee, that's all the ice cracking. I know. You know what? Ideally, we want to be deeper, but we'll try this for a little bit, okay? Yeah. Because let's see how long it takes for you to reel up. Uh, we'll try it for a little bit. We're in the fucking shack. We had to move spots. Yeah. We're in more like, I'd say, around 60 feet-ish. And this is a spot where last year I was hammering them. But this year we got new line. The old reel with the piece together handle. But this seems to do the trick. I'll show you guys the back of the lure. But I won't show you the pattern it has and, until I ca start catching fish. If I catch them. It's my secret weapon. What are you using, Cletus? Just my pink spinner. Yeah. <laughs> we got one here, folks. Hooked up. New pound lake. For real this time. I fucking, yeah, buddy. What do we got? She feels decent. Probably a keeper. Ain't stripping no crazy line or nothing, but. Oh, it feels like it's got decent weight. Oh, 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 look down there, dude. It's what? a big, oh, it's a big <laughs> trout, dude. Oh, it's a keeper. Dude, it's a keeper. Watch out. Hold on. Come on, you. <gasps> Jezebel. That's a beauty. Oh, 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 that's dinner for sure, bud. Dude, that's that's a beauty. Look how pretty it is, dude. Uh, First Laker of the year, we got a two pounder. Yeah. Hey. Oh wow, she ate. Look at them chompers. Wow. Wow. We just got that ni nice trout jigging. We got a tip up right there that we set out a little bit ago. And then we got Nate's way over there. Where is it? Way out there. Yeah. Somewhere. Have a good chance for rainbow out there. But uh, this is the Swedish pimple I'm using. Little graphic. So it definitely works. We oh, have yeah. proven that. Yeah. Now I'll show you how I jig. So drop it all the way down. This is now we're in about 65 feet of water here. This drains most of my spool. See that slack in the line right there? That means obviously that you reach bottom. So what I do is feel where I get tension right about there. Reel down a little bit. Now you can go right on bottom, right off bottom. That's how I jig. Just a couple aggressive strokes. Now, when you get a, when you feel a bite, it's not gonna come in and just take it immediately and start zipping line like a pickerel does, or something like that. What I've experienced in all the trout I've caught jigging is I've been like this. It's either been when I'm holding it right there above the bottom, or if I jig it a little bit, you know, you just jigging, not paying attention, you let it sink, it hits the bottom. As soon as you go to lift up you'll feel dead weight and I'll just see that tip slightly bend just like that and you just lift up and start reeling into them that's what I do yeah I don't do a big old hook set or nothing you can rip it right out of their jaw because sometimes they just get it right in the corner of their lip 
All right, so what just happened? I think I had a bite. <laughs> I'm damn freezing on the line. Sweet ass summertime, what? <laughs> Anyways. Tell them about your aqua view. I have an aqua view. It is really great. That's my aqua view. And it doesn't record, but, but, it has color. Mm -hmm. A lot of them are in black and white, and you can't see what the hell is down there at 70 feet of water. Well, we got the aqua view set up. You can see my jig bouncing up and down right there. So that's his jig. There it is. It's way off there, but we got this thing positioned so perfectly, I don't even want to touch and it. And my minnows. Right there. Somewhere right in the middle. Wait, One I don't know if I can still see my jig. I think it moved. Alright folks, we just had a massive trout come on in. I'm eating goldfish. I spilled them everywhere. I missed it. Shit. Where is he? Fuck. Come on back. Come on back, sweetheart. There was no <gasps> trout. There, there is. There's there two. Oh my god. Start filming. Start filming. Nate. Oh, film. I am. Are you filming? Oh, yeah. Oh my fucking god, dude. Oh, there was two. Yeah, two came outside. in like fire, dude. I know you didn't get that first one on video, but oh, that little one was tiny <clears throat> compared to the one that came in. This, I love this aqua view, dude. Barely even use it every time I go fishing. This is like the second time I've actually used it. Used it. Here we go. We got two Lakers on camera. I just said I'm gonna reel the camera in. Come on. It's coming. It's coming to eat it. Oh, it just sniffed it. It just sniffed it. It just sniffed it. I want to bring the. I want to reel the camera up so I don't spook them. But dude, it's so fun to see them. We're hooked up. I just said, dude, as soon as we take the camera out, I'm going to get one. Now we can get a laser. Ooh! That's exactly what he said. That's a good one, too. I want to see if I can see it under the ice. Yeah, yeah. Start filming over there, Bob. We just reeled the tip-ups in. I literally just dropped down. It hasn't even been a minute into fishing. It feels like it's got decent weight. I see it. Is it good? Oh, my God. Is it good? Yeah, buddy. That's a big one. That's bigger than the first one. Is it? How do you not see that, dude? Oh, there she is. <laughs> Look at that Dude, thing, it's dude. going crazy. Oh, my God, Nathan. Yeah, we're eating good tonight. Should we keep this one or try and get another one? Uh, Well, I yeah, we're going to keep this one. Well, yeah, I just don't know if we should try and get another because they're biting, dude. This well, yeah, but think about this. We can keep two more. Yeah, but this is about... Oh, she's wrapped up. Yeah, it's going to be hard get to get... Get the pliers. I've I might, got them handy. I might release handy. this one. I don't know. Hold on. Oh, that's a... Oh, no! No, it popped out right there! <laughs> All right, well, you released hey, it. Hey, well, uh, sorry for going so crazy right there, but I kind of <laughs> lost my self-esteem. Hey, well, it's okay, because I said we are going to release her, because if it, that just bit that quick, we still got 30 more minutes of fishing. We'll push it till 4. Yeah, So. Let's All right, going. we're going to get back down there, and we'll catch you on the flip side. That's a good fish. Uh, round three, folks. Here we go. All right, maybe I'll keep this one. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. Actually, I'll leave my box. Nate, Nate, just we need do pliers. that later. Do that later. Well, just I'm film, just film, just film. Oh, I am filming. You're not looking at where the camera is. I'm looking for the fish. Oh, dude, dude, come on, dude. Oh, this is a big one. Oh, oh. This is a good one. She's pulling. Oh. Oh my god! Last minute trout. I see it. Is it good? Yeah. Oh that's yeah, a, dude. That's a fatty yeah, dude. Yeah, we'll take that. Oh. She's taking one, dude. We got a screamer! Dude, the only problem with a six inch hole is getting them up into it. Oh. Yeah, it's a struggle, especially when they look Oh, that is a around. fatty. Yeah, I told Not you. Oh, yeah, dude, that's look at that, that guy. Look at, the, the, look at the bubbles it's putting out. I know. That will do, pig. That will do. All right, you little shit. Come here. It won't pop off on the hole now like the last one. Oh, she's wild, dude. She's wild. Oh, this is going to oh. be tricky. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on, yep. hold on, hold on. I don't want to get hooked, dude. Pull it up. There we go. Nice. Good stuff, bud. Let's hold him up for the camp. That ain't a bad trout. Let me turn him. <clears throat> I just don't... What That's do you... a beaut. 
All right, well, as for now, I think this is where we end our video as far as on the ice. And they're on a banger. Here we go. Let's yeah. go cook them up. Sounds good to me. <laughs> you keep painting on the lake. Blew a turbo there. Yeah, no problem. See you later, suckers sitting down there. What did you catch today? Me or them? Them. Probably a cold. <laughs> All right, so we got our catch of the day here that didn't come off at the hole. Uh, this is the first one we got literally 10 minutes into jigging in the bob house in the new spot. And then we got this one at the very end. So we got a beginning and an end fish. But we're going to clean them up. Yeah, it's been frozen since like 11.40, 5 a.m. Yep. So for cleaning a leak trout, it's pretty much the same as every other fish. I'm gonna go under this pectoral fin at angle, diagonally right, right by the gills and under the uh, pectoral fin, all the way down to the spine. That's the spine right there, you'll feel it. Then we're gonna come this way, down the length of the fish. I cook them with the skin on too, so. Oh my god, a little sneak peek. It's like salmon. Alright, so then we're gonna follow it back this way. Just falling right over them spines. And you're just scoring it right along the edge. Basically. Look at that, dude. Look how clean that is. That's beautiful. <clears throat> Wild lake trout. All right, in this one right here, I just got salt, pepper, and a little bit of oil. This one here, I got garlic, Cajun seasoning, salt, pepper. It's this Himalayan sea salt. This stuff's good as hell. But, um, Shotgun shells and a bandolier Cut in stands and dirty boots I brought it out my last good time Like a sin, spit it out I got a spell in this fucking